Good evening, Monstars. Welcome to Monstar Product Review, a section of the website where I go for products that I personally use, personally stand behind, and I've given the Monstar stamp of approval. This crazy looking contraption right here, it's called the Rolflex. Some of you know me, some of you don't know me. I've been diagnosed with extreme tendonitis over the years in both of my arms. I have golfer's elbow and tennis elbow, to keep it on layman's terms. If you don't know really what that is or you've heard those terms thrown around in the gym, he is my close friend, Dr. Joe Tersick. He works at a Symbio PT in Manhattan and he's going to explain a little bit more of what golfer's elbow and tennis elbow really is on a medical level. So what is golfer's elbow? Well, it's actually also termed medial epicondylosis and it's a degenerative condition of typically the pronator teres and flexor carpi radialis tendons shown in the photo, which insert into the medial part of your elbow. And it results from poor mechanics and overuse, whereas tennis elbow or lateral epicondylosis is a degenerative condition of the extensor carpi radialis brevis tendon shown in this photo, as also as a result of microtrauma from poor mechanics. So sometimes these muscles could develop trigger points which is a tender point in the muscle, for example, the forearm, if I press and I find a trigger point, I might feel pain in my elbow or wrist, which is referred pain, and that would be a sign that it's a trigger point. Releasing these trigger points can actually help alleviate some tension in the muscle. Uh, some of the theories behind it are through reducing blood flow to the muscle or reducing neural uh, drive to the muscle and then you actually get a relief of some of the acute symptoms from the medial or lateral epicondylosis and ultimately you'd want a full mechanical assessment on why you're getting this uh, injury and repetitive trauma but for immediate relief you may want to address some of the tension or trigger points in the muscles which can have a big impact immediately. All right fellow monsters. Now that you've watched a video from Dr. Tersik explaining what golfer's elbow and tennis elbow really is in medical terms and how attacking the trigger points might be beneficial for physical therapy. And that's where the Rolflex really comes in handy. The Rolflex is adjustable, so you can use it almost anybody's part. Uh, if you have large forearms, small forearms, doesn't matter. The Rolflex will adapt and is actually able to fit to pretty much anything. Another good thing about the Rolflex is even if you don't have tendinitis in, the, in your arms, this could be used on the neck, the quads, the hands. It's basically like a foam roller. It's a very portable foam roller. Okay. So now what I want to use is my forearm. Basically, I'll move it in. I'll adjust it to the right size. I've been using it on the third setting. And from the video, you saw that the pain is caused from trigger points. And that's what this is going to help attack. My trigger point is actually located right here, believe it or not. In Dr. Tersik's video, he specifically said how it usually hurts in the insertion points and he's dead on. My pain is actually right here, the major trigger point, and I do have another trigger point deep into the tricep, right here. The one that hurts the most, honestly, and the one that causes the most discomfort for me is going to be the trigger point that's on the top of my forearm. So you set up the roll flex, you can set it anywhere, you can be laying down, that's why I'm doing it in the office today, because I want to show you usually when I'm watching TV, this is when I roll. So I have the roll flex, we open it up just a little to get your hand in there, obviously. Basically, in the beginning, you're going to use it as a regular roller. You're going to push down on your leg and you keep it sturdy. You're going to move it around in all different directions. Now, you see the green roller is actually indented for more severe cases of tendonitis. It has, you could also use the regular roller. You can spin it right around and basically just roll it on out. You could use either side. Uh, the black roller is usually more for just everyday use. Uh, staying mobile, staying on top of your tendonitis before it becomes like mine, my chronic pain. So that's basically what the black roll is for. But since mine is on the severe side, and honestly, most of my physical therapists are using ART therapy, and Dr. Tersik, he is my PT actually, and we've gone over so many things from my shoulder to my knees to my ankles. And one of the few things he's actually showed me is how the trigger point response and ART therapy has actually successfully worked for me personally. So now with this, if you want to manipulate the trigger points, this is what we're going to do. You're going to roll it in. You're going to find your trigger point. Dig it. You'll find it. You'll know exactly. You'll be in it, but if you're not really in it, in it, it, it you, you'll know. You can feel it. There's a big difference in the feeling. So now I'm going to roll it a little bit just to get it going. 
and I'm going to find it. Mine is, nope, not right there yet, not there yet, right there. Okay, I found it. Now, what we're going to do, we're going to squeeze this. I'm going to apply pressure. And that's the greatest thing about this product. You apply your own pressure, and if you're not applying enough at this, at this size, you just make it a little bit smaller. So you can have the right, ang the right angles and the right leverages. So now, we're going to get squeeze. Now, over the years, I've learned that the, one of the best therapies for tendonitis is flossing. So basically what we're going to do is we're going to just squeeze and apply pressure to the trigger point, and then we're going to floss the forearm. So we're going to move it left, we're going to go right, keep going for a few seconds, up, down. You can see the fingers, how the fingers are actually difficult to move. You think that this is an easy movement right now, but with all the tendons under pressure and because they're already stuck in their shortened state, you feel it. I feel the tendons all the way down into my wrists and my fingernails and my fingers, actually. I feel it. So now, once we get better at this, the hand open, we're going to open it all the way, make a fist. Oh, when I make the fist, that's when I really feel it. Basically, over from the powerlifting years of benching and having a clenched fist has really messed this up. So we're going to get the fist. Same thing. Circles. Circle. Ooh. I wish you guys could hear the crunch and the... Ooh, and that's it. It's really basically how we're going to use this tool for golfer's elbow and tennis elbow. Oh, man, it feels great. But I got to say, like when you, once you get done with it, you feel it. And you feel the blood rush back in. It's pretty much like a buddy, a personal friend of yours that's going to help you do your PT with you for your forearms. Both forearms, as I said, boom, 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 boom. It's very simple. The way it's set up, it's very portable. Now, real quick before this video is over. I know how I explained how this was used for tennis. It's very simple if you saw how I used it. So I explained how I do recommend this for forearm tendinitis, uh, golfer's elbow and tennis elbow. This, is, this has been a very big tool in my arsenal against it. Now, foam rolling and other mobility work, of course, I believe in it. I'm just very lazy, and this has helped me start doing little things here and there. One thing I did notice with the Roflex is you can, it comes with, awesome basically comes with little pamphlets on how to do certain exercises boom that's it look look seriously it's actually really 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 in depth on how to basically hit every other muscle you got in every other group now another cool thing is right see this when you take this you're gonna wrap this around just like that so now you got a handle, and believe it or not, the way it's built and designed is so you can hit other nagging muscles and other nagging tendons all around your body. It comes with a strap so you can do your shoulders, so you can do almost every single thing you do with a foam roller with this bad boy, with this little contraption. Uh, it's big enough to hit your quads. Another benefit of people that like the foam roll and IT bend their quads. So basically what we're going to do is we're going to attach it. We're obviously going to use the biggest setting, right? Obviously. So, boom. How easy is this? Simple. Get it in. And you just basically take it and you're going to roll it. How hard is that, honestly? Oh. See, my trigger points... See, I don't like using this one on, on for the legs because I really don't have too many trigger points, but I'll use the bottom foam roller and apply pressure up just to hit the hammies because I always have tight hammies. It's one of the main things that I have back pain. See, now, if you don't even want to use this piece for this, you add, it's fine. You could, this one has the handles on it, and you can hit the right, whoo, shoot. Oh, right there. You can find yourself and manipulate it to the point where you find the right spot. Top of the quads, roll them out. There you go. That's it. It's one of the very simple and effective tools in your battle against tendonitis. Not a lot of products I stand behind in terms of mobility work, but this one, it's one of the few that allows you to do the PT work that you're prescribed by your physical therapist when you get home and you have no excuses. This bad boy can be found on Amazon or on their website. I recommend Amazon. I go to Amazon for everything. I'm a primer. So on our website, we have a Monster approved product site. If you actually are thinking about picking this up, 
and you can't find it, just go to that, just go to our Monster Approved section. You'll see it. It links right to Amazon. I, I pretty much went on, personally picked the ads too, because I wanted to get the cheapest one, exactly like this. I don't need you guys paying $80 for something that I got for 50 So I believe this thing should cost between 50 to $57, free shipping if you got Prime. So no excuses, Monstars. This is your battle tool to finally stopping that tendonitis that you've been battling over the years that you can't get rid of. All right, Monstars, this is the Roflex. This definitely has the Monstar seal of approval.